another day, another load of uh, Keith Barker wickets this season. Yeah, it's um, it's gone all right. It went pretty well. We've um, been working really hard with the ball. Um, today was my day, um, but you know I think we've all been putting in efforts, and I'm sure it should be uh, one of the other lads at some point in the next game, next few games. As you say, you're all putting in the overs at the moment. I think you're well over all over 100 overs this this season. That it's hard, hard graft out there, and you're getting your rewards. Yeah, it is. It's, it's not been easy. Um, obviously, last week at Kent was a real flat wicket. Um, we put in a, some good hard yards there. We just keep going as much as we can. We know um, if we can get one or two wickets earlier, just at uh, any point in the game, we can you know, get a few more after that. So we just keep pushing as hard as we can, and it seems to go pretty well. This morning, I think you took six, seven wickets this morning between you. After yesterday, obviously losing five wickets, it seems like a really good good wicket to take early wickets on. It is, yeah. I mean, um, let's say we, I think Langs probably got the better of the wicket yesterday, first session. Um, just started to dry out a bit. I think we've had to just kind of watch how we bowled and you not know, bowl to our plans, which has is, which is worked. Um, they got probably a bit closer than what we'd have liked, but um, we've just got to keep keep going, keep grafting. It seemed like a little bit of extra bounce you were getting, especially this morning, that on a length they saw a couple of them sort of leaped up a little bit. Yeah, I think a bit with a bit of uh, cloud cover and the ball was a little bit harder um, earlier on today, so that did help with a bit of bounce, but once the ball gets to about 40 odds old, it did start to get a bit soft, so we've just got to like stick in there and hope the batsmen make mistakes. It looked like you were going to put on a really big lead and then sort of they had that little partnership. Is that slightly frustrating at that period? Um, kind of happens doesn't it ebbs and flows throughout the four days um i thought they, they you know they batted well they grinded grinded out um and then they looked to just punish anything that they thought was a bad ball so we um you know we we obviously would have wanted to take those wickets earlier but you just got to take your next chance when it comes and six runs was the difference in the end in the first innings that that sound seems a bit fair a quite fair based on what we've seen over the first two days really yeah, I mean, um, like I said, we'd have liked to have had a few more um, deficit, but um, I think we'd have taken that after where we were after the first session on day one. And then obviously that last session of the day, everything felt like it got even a bit that you put on, got the lead back over 100, but lost three wickets at the same time. How do you sort of see that last, last session? Yeah, I think uh, one or two of those were unfortunate, um, but it happens, you know, we've just got to look forward to tomorrow and just, you know, start afresh when the um, doors look really good there and they've just got to scrap and you know get the bowlers coming back and bowling spell after spell. It's a big for a big first session if that's not a big cliche. Yeah it is, it always is. Every every session is a big session. Um, you can't look too far ahead and that's why we just focus on the next session and go from there. And back on to you for slightly to end up with I think you're the leading wicket taker in Division 1 this season. You've got your 20 wickets that I guess that's exactly what you sort of trained over the winter for and sort of what you what you want really. Yeah, as I said, it's been my my day last few few games I've done pretty well but it's more of a collective thing of how we do as a bowling union, as a team. Um, a lot, some of the lads have bowled really well and not got the, the luck that they deserve so I'm sure it'll be their point uh, and I'll be in the background just wishing it was my turn but we just keep going and keep working hard. Thank you very much. Cheers.